Hey guys, welcome to Macintosh Weekly, and today in this video, I'm going to show how to install Fedora Linux on Apple Silicon Macs natively. If you're new to the channel, make sure to subscribe, and now let's begin. If you're an Apple Silicon Mac user, you may be aware that except for Mac OS, you can't install any of the OS natively. Virtualization is possible using Parallels, UTM, VMware, etc. But this guide is focused on installing Fedora on bare metal. To install Fedora Linux on Apple Silicon Macs natively, you'll need to make sure that you have at least 58 gigabytes of free space on your Mac boot drive, 20 for Fedora Linux, and 38 reserved for Mac OS updates. Also, an internet connection is required. After making free space, open the terminal and execute the following command. To run the installer as root, enter your password and press the Enter key. Now again, press Enter to continue with the installer. This installer will guide you through the process of setting up Fedora Linux on your Mac. Now you need to resize an existing partition to make space for the new OS. For that, press R key on your keyboard, then press the Enter key. Now enter a size such as MGB, a fraction such as 50%, or the word min for the smallest allowable size. After entering the value, press the Enter key and then confirm resizing by pressing Y key, then press the Enter key. After the resizing is completed, press the Enter key and now press the F key to install an OS into free space and then press Enter key to proceed. Now select any version of the OS you want to install, enter the number and then press the Enter key. Now you'll need to allocate the space for the new OS, type Max and press the Enter key to proceed. Now enter a name for your OS and press the Enter key and wait until the process is finished. Now, to continue the installation, you will need to enter your Mac OS admin credentials. Enter the password and press Enter key. To be able to boot your new OS, you will need to complete one more step. Press the Enter key to continue. After getting the shutdown option, press the Enter key to shut down the system map. Wait for 15 seconds after your system shuts. Now press and hold down the power button to power on the system. Release once you see loading, startup options or spinner and wait for the volume list to appear after the volume list appears. Choose Fedora, then click on continue. You will briefly see a Mac OS recovery dialog. If you are asked to select a volume recovery, then choose your normal Mac OS volume and click next. You may need to authenticate yourself with your Mac OS credentials, when required. Now follow the prompts in the terminal window. After it loads, press Enter to continue and proceed with your Mac OS credentials, when required. Now press the Y key on your keyboard, then press the Enter key and proceed with your Mac OS credentials, when required. After the installation is completed, press the Enter key to reboot and you'll be booted to Fedora.
And here you can see Fedora Setup screen is here. Click on Start Setup and set up your Fedora installation accordingly. and you're all done. Fedora has been successfully installed on your Apple Silicon-based Mac. Now let me just give a quick look of the Fedora on Apple Silicon. And as you saw, the installation works as expected. So that was it. Hope it was useful. Consider like for the video, subscribe to the channel, and if you have any question, just comment down below. Thanks for watching and have a great day ahead.